What is up everybody? It's October 12, 2022 in Big Bear Lake, California. We're getting some more rain. Not, not really unexpected, but um, the chances went down as of this morning. So I'm surprised that we're actually getting anything right now. However, it's a nice sight to see. It's not much at the moment. So we're just gonna run to my house real quick so we can complete this video. But yeah, it's, you know, I hope I'm not annoying the heck out of you guys. Um, hope everybody is well. Happy almost winter time to everybody. This is gonna be great. San Gorgonio, you guys, got some snow yesterday. So San Gorgonio already has snow. I'm super excited about this. Um, I, <laughs> are you excited, beautiful wife? Yep. Super excited. She's super thrilled. Not. <laughs> I'm gonna be a popsicle. Yeah. It's she's exciting. <laughs> All right, hang tight, guys. Okay, you all, I'm back. Stopped at the house to drop off my wife, but also pick up one of my dogs. I have two dogs now because my wife has dogs. And this is Theo. I want you guys to meet Theo. Theo, say hi, buddy. Say hi, buddy. He's so cute. Oh my gosh, he is so adorable. That's my buddy. That's my new little buddy. He loves, he loves Nick so much. He loves me so much. So anyway, we're gonna look out towards the, the, the dam part of town, way out there. And yeah. Looks like we got some good stormage coming in straight through here, but I don't know if we're gonna be underneath that little swath. But either way, we're just gonna do a short little video today. Wow, I miss you guys a lot. I'm so excited when I get to do videos because I get to communicate with you guys. And that makes me so happy. This one makes me so happy. I'm a very happy camper. All right, so we're on Fox Farm Road, like we were yesterday a little bit. Um, we're just gonna take kind of short neighborhood shortcuts through here. Unfortunately, I don't have my uh, my other phone that I used yesterday to record, so we're using my regular phone. You all right back there, Theo? You're a good boy, huh? He's a good boy. He's a good boy. shower. It wasn't anything significant though, but it was nice. So when it started raining, my wife and I, we were going to the drive-thru at El Pollo Loco. And I love doing this so much, like I'm, I'm not going to eat to do the video, you know. I'll go back and get something later. I love you guys. I love doing this. Like it's 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 so much fun um, because it gets me out of my head. It totally gets me out of my head. All I'm thinking about is you guys and the weather. Okay. Oh, this road we're going or. take a little swing through part of Moon Ridge up here and then come back down and we'll go through the roundabout on the way home. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's really not that exciting, but uh, in Big Bear, you gotta, you gotta find excitement. You gotta make things exciting. 
as I said in a previous video, I, I don't know why I'm so thrilled and excited to do uh, to drive through a roundabout. Like it's uh, I don't know. It's like we got a new hotel in town or something. <laughs> but anyway, hope everyone is kicking butt and taking names. Hope you guys are staying healthy out there and uh, working hard and just enjoying life. I struggle with that as well. Life is not easy. We all have a lot of stuff we have to go through. It's just, I've always believed we're all given a huge bowl of uh, nonsense on this earth, but it's just how we deal with it individually. And I'm tired of being a victim in life and blaming other things to give me a reason to not have to try hard. So I sucked it up, stopped whining and complaining, and good things are happening in my life a few years later, so it's a beautiful thing. All right, so what we're gonna do is turn right, or turn left here and go by on the golf course. So we're gonna go this direction. And then, yeah, guys, don't forget, when it snows, I drive the whole town, like the whole thing. So, especially because I like to show you guys what I coined as the Big Bear Snow Rule. And what that means is that one side of town always gets significantly more snow than just the opposite end of the valley, which is only eight miles away. Same elevation and everything. But for instance, if we get like a foot of snow at the Big Bear Dam, there will only be about an inch at in Baldwin, an inch or two. It's just incredible. And I've proven that through seven years of snowstorms. It's every every single storm. Um, but you know we get hit and hammered hard when uh, the northern parts of Baldwin have a lot of snow. I mean, when, when, when they get like six inches to a foot, then, then you know that we got three or four feet on this side of town. So it, it, it's awesome. And as I said, it, it, it works regularly. It's, uh, that's why I decided to coin that term, the Big Bear Snow Rule. So he's pulling over or around a blind, blind bend. Thank you, dude. Hole number one of our beautiful golf course right here. I mean, it is gorgeous. I, I, I didn't get to play there at all this year. I got married. some of these people they drive like animals up here but <laughs> i know that was me though you guys gave me so much crap my first few years because i was driving like a maniac i still kind of do i don't use chains you guys and i drive like like uh yeah i don't use chains and i create the snow tracks i'm out there hitting tracks before the snow plows even get to it so but yeah guys this is going to be full of snow in about a month and a half full of snow super loving it super loving it like mcdonald's i'm loving it all right anyway that wasn't funny that was not funny i am not funny
beautiful golf course. Ah, oh, these clouds look magnificent. All right, so we're gonna be going through the roundabout right up here, then we're gonna head back to the homestead, get this video uploaded for y'all. I'm so obsessive compulsive about making these videos any weather we get, you guys. At least any different weather than like sun. Wow, that was sweet. I just pulled that maneuver really good, really well. Oh, hey, Mr. Roundabout. Gas, I need to get gas in this beast. Once again, you guys, it's October 12th, 2022. Um, thank you guys again for everything. Thank you for always being so sweet to me. Um, I, I know people could be really mean if they wanted to, and you guys have always been really nice to me. If you go back many years on these videos, I, 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 didn't, I didn't have a filter. So for a few comments that weren't too nice, like I would explode using all the curse words and stuff. And, just being a child, but I just want to thank you guys for being so loving and supportive of me, and I will always be here for you guys. Thank you for everything, and I love you all very much. You take care.